On 28, we want to, we want to, well, 28 is going to be different. On 26, we want to equate the bases. This is kind of like when we were doing uh, these problems over here. If I had something like this, I wanted to equate the bases. But this one's already set up for us ready to do it. So this is going to be um, 2 to the x minus 4 equals, how else can I rewrite 8? Well, I can rewrite it as 2 cubed. But I still have other exponents up there, right? So I rewrite 8 as 2 cubed, but then I've got these other exponents that I have to um, put with that 3. So now that my bases are the same, I can ignore my bases, and I can set x minus 4 equal to 3 times negative 2x plus 1. Um, so x minus 4 equals negative 6x plus 3. I'm going to add my 6x. And I'm going to add my 4 over here. So I end up with 7x equals 7, so x equals 1. Um, and you could always plug that in to check. So this would be 2 to the negative 3. 2 to the negative 3 over there. 8 to the negative 2 times 1 is negative 2, plus 1 is negative 1. 8 to the negative 1. Um, and this is 1 over 2 cubed, and this is 1 over 8. And you can see that those are going to be the same.